thanks to the Perth Game Fishing Club and their FADS program, every summer we can enjoy quality sport fishing out of Perth. The FADS are a long way for a small boat to travel, and leaving the Coburn boat ramp in calm conditions, myself and Ryan didn't expect to see such a big chop behind Rotto, so he had to work fast if he wanted some dolphin fish. Dollies are quite a prize for the small boat angler, and by trolling small skirted lures and flies, you can have an absolute ball on one of the ocean's most spectacular fish. Yep, I'm on! I'm on, on Steve! I'm on, double I'm hook on. up! Woo! Oh, they're going oh. ballistic! Oh, I don't know, I think I dropped mine, I can't even tell what's going oh, on. Oh, look at that! No, I haven't. Oh, you're on as well? Yeah, it's pandemonium! Oh. Double hook up! I've got, he's running at me. <laughs> All right, we're back. Woo! Oh, he's going ballistic. They're only little. Well, mine is. I don't know about yours. Yeah, I think mine's smaller like yours as well, mate. I'll let you get yours in a little bit. Yep. I'm calm. I'm calm. How are you going? Oh, this is great. Oh, oh isn't that that's great? That's a beautiful coloured fish there. That's great. Oh, look. And he's grabbed Dennis Rogers. Fantastic fly. Fly fishing with spinning gear. There you go. <laughs> Fantastic. Have a look. Oh, beautiful. He's wolfed that fly. You want to handle that, Steve, or you're right? No, no, I'm right. Just see if I can get him to go coloured up in the water. Have a look. What a beautiful fish. And he's wolfed that fly down his gob. Don't need to net him. We'll just lift him in. <laughs> Doesn't want to come in. Calm down, my friend. Calm down. <laughs> we'll just let him have a bit of fun down there. Let him do his thing. He's all right. Are you right now? Are you going to come and see Steve? There you go. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Right, up you come. I've had enough of you. That is one fantastic little dolly. Look at the colours. Oh, Even the little ones are just beautiful. And the fly, have a look. Absolutely fantastic. He thought that was a little tiny bait fish, maybe a flying fish. And we're just going to get that out and pop him straight back. How you going, mate? Good. I've still got my fish, Steve. Still got him. Just in time. This Here we go. Awesome. Colour. Oh, fantastic. It's coming up. Get mine back. Oh! Oh, she's taking line again. Look at that. Either Jeez. mine is a lot smaller than what you've got on, or you're just being a big wuss about bringing this in. Mate, nah, I, you're that's the right. same size, I think. It's, oh, look at that. Awesome. Yeah, the same size as yours, Steve. There we go. Right. Excellent, thank you. Now, Ryan has a leader on here, quite a long one. You can see his swivel is right at the top there. And he's got pretty much a leader you'd use for sailfish or something like that. And we're just going to let this fish have a bit of a bunter in the water. <laughs> and when he's right, we'll bring him on board. <laughs> You're right there? Look, I've got one, Ryan. Hairlining. <laughs> Okay, you're done now. They have to be the most difficult fish to deal with on board of any fish in the ocean. All right. Look at that. Look at the colour. And he's wolfed down those hooks. What have you got there, mate? This has actually come out of its mouth. Oh, Just when you brought it on board. Obviously, yeah. this is what it's been look. feeding on, the small bait fish. And look at that. Look at the size comparison, see? The head and the skirt match the that. hatch, as Marcy would hatch. say, if you fly fishing for trout. Oh. Look at that, in the light, on cue, back he goes. Beautiful colours. Only oh, one thing better than that, it. mate, I reckon. Fly rod time. Absolutely. Let's do it. It's good. Dolphin fish are, of course, not related to dolphins, but more closely to queen fish than anything else. They're attracted to the fads, or fish aggregating devices, because they provide both food and shelter. Often, when fishing up north, you'll see schools of dollies huddled under a floating log or other debris, and that's why the Perth Game Fishing Club sets these fads to attract them and other fish like marlin to a certain area. Now, rather than driving all over the ocean, you can use your GPS to set a course that will contain fish more often than not. These coordinates can always be found on the fishingwa.com website, by the way. Sometimes I'll troll small flies on my fly rod to get the dolphin fish interested. Pink's a great colour, but I also like green and blue flies, almost the same colour as the dolphin fish themselves. If you persevere, even in rough weather, you'll usually get a few fish, but only if you've seen them on top of the water. If the fad's empty, move on to the next one. 
All right, mate. Oh, I got gotcha. you. He's in. Oh, it's a good fish too. Nice bit of weight. Oh, look at it go. Now you've got to fish oh. on. I'm going to try stripping this fly back. But I don't think I'll do any good in this chop. And then, mate. Mate, take a line. Oh, yeah. That's a better fish, Steve. That's a good fish. The better fish. I'll tell you what, this could be Still. the last one for the day because that weather's closing in, so make it a good one, mate. I think I'm giving up on the fly fishing. It's all getting a bit hairy out here. Good hook up. Oh, jeez. As soon as you get straight by the fad, yep. bang. Yep. These particular fish are holding in close, these ones. These I think fish. that's because of the uh, weather being a little oh. bit choppy. This one's going, Steve. Well, mate. This has got a lot more punch than that last fish. You've filled it up now. <laughs> so everyone at home wants to have a look at it. So if you lose it, you're going to look <laughs> stupid, you know. You better land it. We're looking all right here, I think. Pressure's on. Pressure's on. I just had a bit of a sit down. It's coming up. They're a strange fish. The dolphin fish because they run like a mackerel, they jump like a queen fish, and then they get their head down like a trevally. So you get the best of both worlds, but luckily they don't quite do the old trevally and tuna under the boat circle, do they? No, that's correct. This one's staying a little bit deeper, not playing on the surface as much. Yep, got colour. Oh, excellent. Hang on. We won't get the net. Oh, oh, oh that's look at a beauty. That. What a beautiful fish. That's yes. a better He's going to go up here. I don't want to really try and bully oh, him at the moment. Oh, look how good it is, Steve. Look at that. That is fantastic. <laughs> he's oh, going to go nuts. That. It's right inside his mouth. He's going to go nuts. I don't want him on board in this shape because he's what we call green, which normally means highly active, but he actually is green. Oh, he's gone blue now. Look at that. Oh, isn't that beautiful? That's a good fish. I'm just holding him here to show you all how they change colours. Oh, he's strong as. Strong as. Oh. I shouldn't have been messing with him, should I? But you can see he changed from green to blue. I want to have a look at that. It just looks great. We're going to put him back. Oh, he's oh. pulled. Oh, <laughs> no. There he is. He's swimming off. And I've got a bath. But that's all right. It's about to rain anyway. What a fantastic thing to see, glowing up at the boat like that. We tried to get him in. He was just too strong. We're going to let him go anyway, mate. Hi. Awesome lure, awesome bit of fishing. Thank you very much. This is great. The fads. You should come sometime.